Hey people, how are you doing? Hope everybody's good. I um, had a conversation um, the other day with the, an energy company and um, the woman told me, the woman that I spoke to told me the following. She said that um, the price of gas in Europe is capped <coughs> and that um, because I asked her why why are the bills doubling what is what is it I don't understand how how does sending a current down the, the wire um, how has that the cost of that doubled so she said um, that in Europe um, specifically in Europe that um, there is a research project going on right <clears throat> the research project is that um they are looking for cheaper ways to produce electricity and so as they don't when electricity supplies are low they use gas to produce electricity i think that's bullshit but anyway <clears throat> um so i said to her well they already know the cheapest way to uh, produce electricity because Nikola Tesla gave us that information uh, over a hundred years ago so electricity is free and we know that so and she said well actually I, I agree with you <clears throat> however uh, yeah like everyone it's always I agree with you but my job my job oh I need my my wages to pay my bills and my mortgage crap my fake bills and my fake mortgage that's fraud <clears throat> from the outset so um so i said to her, okay so this research project then so so she said yes so what they're doing is it runs for a year it ends in may 2023 and she said um and the cost of it is being added to the consumer's bills okay so half of your bill is to pay for a project to for them to so-called look for ch uh, cheaper ways to produce electricity when they already know the way to make it for free okay just to let you know so <clears throat> i said to her so okay but they haven't disclosed that to the consumer so that would be um a void contract and you shouldn't have to pay that you haven't agreed to pay the cost of that i said i'm not being funny you know we've got um the energy companies the likes of british gas bp etc reporting that they're making billions in profit um this year so um i think british gas was like i don't know five billion or something and bp was the same so i said why are they not paying for it out of their own billions of pounds of profit she said i don't know that's that's just what they're doing so they're adding it to the consumer's bill because the consumer's going to consume it in the end. Um, but she said, I agree with what you're saying about the Tesla tech. <clears throat> so there you have it. You've been lied to. Um, the Ukraine has nothing to do with the energy crisis at all. Absolutely nothing. Um, so um, they've gone, Russia, so-called Russia, has gone into the Ukraine to shut down the bio labs. Such labs where such so-called viruses or bioweapons like COVID-19 were designed. China, as Donald Trump explained it, Shipil China, not China in Asia. <clears throat> so um, basically, um, and then, you know, we, it, we, it was reported that... Um, the likes of the Clintons, Hunter Biden, etc., etc. All these people were making money out of the Ukraine. The Ukraine is the chief money laundering place in uh, in Europe, and um, or in fact the world. And you know they are promoting child trafficking, human trafficking, etc. And it is so basically now what's happening is they are. 
they can't do that anymore and um so but they still need to launder their money don't they so how the hell would they do that oh let's pretend there's an energy crisis let's pretend we have a research project project to make electricity cheaper because we don't need to do that really because we've got the tech that makes it free already and we've had that for over 100 years so um let's just pretend that we're doing a project to to make it cheaper than free right <laughs> and then um what we'll do is we'll add that to the consumer's bill so what we're going to do the, the energy crisis is that they are now these so-called people that are not elite by any, in any way shape or form are using the energy companies to launder their dirty money so we have been cleaning house for a long time and now the energy companies are being exposed for what they are because they've been selling you energy for years and years and years and years and pretending that it costs money, pretending that gas is scarce and oil is becoming scarce and electricity is becoming more expensive. No, electricity is free. Gas is ever replenishing and so is oil. It's produced by the earth. So this is all nonsense all bullshit to get you to complete your schooling i.e your slave training for what 15 years and then and then complete your actual slavery until you're old and decrepit and fucking worn out so um <clears throat> and that is not life it is not life you, you you go to school to learn a, lo a, a crock of shit, basically, and um, very little truth. And then you go to work for 50 years or more, sometimes. And then, you know, when you're old, you know, I saw somebody in a supermarket a few weeks ago and uh, they had put a, um, a bottle of sun cream in their till yeah sorry in there in they, i was at the till they were in front of me paying and they put a bottle of sun cream in their in their basket and the woman rang it up and um it was about three or four quid more expensive than what they thought it said on uh on the on the thing it was in one of these little shelves near the near the till and they picked it up and then the guy was going no 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 look it says says 188 here and the woman said no 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 that's that's the one next to it that's a different one and um, this one's like four ninety nine or something, and they put it back. <clears throat> so um, me being me, I said to them, they were an old couple, probably about, I reckon about late sixties, early seventies, and I said to them, you know, you just did yourself a huge favour because all the chemicals in that cause cancer anyway. Um, so um, by putting that back, I said you've saved yourself from from all that toxic crap. And uh, the, the, the woman just smiled and the guy said, at my age, I really don't need to worry about all that. He goes, but thanks anyway. And I said, well, actually, at your age, I said, you, you do need to worry about that. Because the thing is, is at your age, I said, you've spent your whole life um, doing your due diligence and diligently paying tax and working really hard for your family, most probably. I said, you look like that type of guy to me. I said, and now you it, it's your time to enjoy your life and um and and your family and most probably your grandchildren and stuff. And um so it does matter more than ever at your age because you've worked so hard and um and uh basically um you you don't want to get to that point of your life and then suddenly you're struck down with cancer. So, um, so it really matters for people like you. So that's why I'm telling you because I actually care about people, whether I know you or not, um, it's not an issue and whether you're just, you know, the next person in the till in front of me, uh, um, that I've never, um, met before or seen before. Um, I, I actually care. So, um, that's why I said it. And he just said, that's really kind of you. And, um, thank you for what you said. So, um, <clears throat> just, you know, we just face a lot of bullshit and know that, 
you create everything in your world. So um, if you don't want to, you know, I'm just providing you a bit of information. So if you see this video, then you created me to give you that information. I was actually quite gobsmacked when the woman, um, when the woman at the energy company said it. And um, I couldn't, I couldn't believe my, my ears. I was sort of shocked. She disclosed this information. And I thought, wow. So yeah, the energy companies are now being exposed and I'm, um, I had to uh, let everyone know because people need to know the truth and they need to know um, what's going on and know why they're, you know, at least an explanation of why has my bill doubled? Why does a current down a wire cost twice as much now? Why does um, diesel or petrol or, you know, why is it costing twice as much? Why? Why? Because... Uh, the people that we seek to make obsolete um, because of their fraud and corruption are, are on their last legs trying to launder their last bit of cash out. <laughs> Basically, that's it. So um, it won't work. It never works. It always the story and the truth always comes out um, very quickly these days. It's manifested and uh, brought out to the masses. So... Um, there we go. Uh, just thought I'd let you all know that. Hope everyone's good and um, I'll speak to you soon. Bye.